what's good my beautiful family and welcome back to another video today i am going to be packing for a london trip and i am going to be showing you in detail and in depth of how i pack and the things that i am packing for my trip when it comes to like outfits things that i need skincare hair care and really just show you how i stay organized whenever i do pack and things that have actually changed my whole travel experience when it comes to staying organized because i used to be that messy person who would like overpack and then like not even feel like i had everything i needed whenever i was at the trip so um i am going to be giving you some uh, great tips that will change your packing forever so let's get into the video i am very excited to film it and um yeah Don't mind the closet because it is kind of messy. Now, the way that I choose outfits is literally by choosing a couple of jackets and then trying to like make different outfits from those jackets or from the shoes that I'm bringing. And I don't like to overpack too many things. So since it's going to be raining and it's gonna be cold, I'm gonna be packing coats and boots. And then I am going to put on the outfit. I'm gonna take a picture of it and then I'm gonna put it into an album because every single time that I need a fit, I don't want to waste time stressing about what I'm going to wear whenever I'm traveling. I'd rather spend the time now and then whenever I get there, I'm like instantly ready. All I have to do is probably like steam it so there's no wrinkles. So um, this is the part that it's going to take a minute. So I have to pick five casual outfits in two nice fits. The first thing that I have chosen is a white button up with black pants and I'm going to layer it which I honestly love layering and especially because you can like reuse the same piece and wear it with like different undertops to create different fits. And so I am bringing the white undertop a little bit out just to like give it more of a design. I think it looks cool. I'm not gonna style my hijab right now, but I usually like do some sort of style that will go well with the fit. So because the sweater is like cut at the bottom, I like how the white comes underneath. And then, because it's gonna be cold and rainy in London, I am gonna wear a jacket over it. So I have this black trench coat. I'm iffy on this one. I, I mean, like, I like it, but I don't know if it's a bit too masculine. Obviously, I can dress it up with jewelry and, like, a nice purse. And then I am gonna wear my sneakers with it because a tad bit of gray and a tad bit of white. And I think that the shoes really sit nice on the pants. I'm really about to start sweating in here. Okay, I'm not exactly sure what hijab style that I will do, but that is honestly probably the most challenging thing for me is like matching my hijab style with the outfit that I'm wearing. But because this is like a somewhat masculine fit, I need to do more of like a, I don't know, a hijab style that's like maybe a bit flowy. Okay, now I'm contemplating this outfit. This is literally the problem with like choosing your fits ahead of time. <sighs> I think I like it without the black coat. I think the black coat was just way too many layers. So I'm gonna pair it with like some gold details and gold jewelry. I think that's gonna like spice it up. I'm like really indecisive about this fit. And honestly, whenever you are planning your fits, this is gonna happen. So make sure you have time when you are doing it and do not overthink it. Okay, now I'm adding some jewelry with the fit and a little bit of accessories. Literally jewelry can change a whole outfit. I think I like this fit. It's growing on me. The next thing I do, I'm going to make sure I take a picture of every single fit and then I'm going to place it into an album and call it London Fits. Okay, let's put on outfit number two. Number two, we are doing another button up. If you follow me on Instagram, which if you don't, make sure you follow me, then you've probably already seen this top. I am literally the CEO of re-wearing outfits and I do not care. I'm going to make sure that I make use of everything that I bring because I do not want to overpack. So styling the same pieces in different ways is going to save you so much 
and not freak out about like, you know, always wearing the same outfit. So I am doing this top with the same gray sweater that I literally just had on, but I'm pairing it with gray jeans. Let's put it together. I like to bring the sleeves up over the sweater. These boots today, not today, whenever I wear it. So this is fit number two and in the back it is longer. Yo, I have to leave in literally three, three hours. Okay. Anyways, I really like this fit, but you can be the judge of it. I also want to know what's your favorite fit in the comments below and make sure you subscribe. Because it's gonna be raining in London, I am bringing my favorite rain jacket. So I can use this jacket in many different ways. It's very versatile, so I can dress it up or dress it down. I am pairing this jacket with a black undertop and some navy blue pants. The pants have like the stripe coming down on the side, which I think is super cool. The green with the navy blue and then a touch of black. You can wear boots with it or instead of sneakers, we can do heels. I think this fit would probably go better with silver jewelry. So instead of the gold, we will do silver jewelry. And I am gonna pair it with a black bag. The next outfit is going, I don't know how I'm feeling about these gloves, but I really like this coat and I think it just works well with like a pair of jeans and a basic layering piece. I am probably going to reuse this black top and these same jeans multiple times. It depends if I'm like taking fit pics or something. I don't know, I'll switch it up, but like I really like to keep it simple because I just don't want to, yeah, I just, I just like to keep it simple. I'll probably style it with like some jewelry and necklaces. I don't know about this bag with it. I like how the jeans just sit nicely on the shoe. I don't know how I feel about these gloves with this outfit, but I do really like it. Let me put on a black coat with the gloves and see how that looks. But I think I am gonna bring this coat just in case. Or we have this black coat. This is just, I just love a long trench coat. It's just, oof, you know what I'm saying? I think this looks well with the gloves because it's like just black coming out. I will probably wear my loafers with this fit. Trench coat, gloves, jeans, loafers. I think I like the brown better. I don't know if I even want to bring the black. I'll probably bring the black just in case, but I think it's too dark. This is literally what I'm talking about because I'm such a like hectic person. I want to deal with all the stress right now instead of dealing with the stress whenever I get there. This is not good. I have to leave to the airport in two hours. I get the worst travel anxiety, like the worst, but we're calm, okay? I am literally like calming myself down. I don't know. Do we like this or do we prefer the first look with the heels, the jeans and the black top? I'm about to start freaking out. My mind is playing games on me and I'm like liking a fit and then I'm like not liking it. So I am going to bring this coat and the black coat and then I'm just gonna like have layering tops as well. And I think it's good to bring layering pieces anyways, like different color tops, just in case you do want to change your mind about a fit. Cause sometimes you'll like something and then when you get there and you put it on, you're like, mm, I actually don't like it. So make sure you bring layering pieces as well. So you can like style with coats and then jeans. Yeah, we're gonna do this one. And then I'm also gonna bring the black coat. This is the last fit that I'm going to put on because I have like two hours until I really have to leave. So I have on this under top, which is like blue. And then I'm pairing it with a white button up shirt and it's just long in the back. I love like long tops like this, which is like so hard to find. Okay, so here is the final fit and my heels. I'm probably gonna wear gold jewelry with this fit, but this is just like a casual kind of nice dinner outfit. Mm, should I put a jacket over it? I'm gonna be completely honest with you. I love nice things. Like when it comes to fashion, I do like quality pieces, but I've started to learn so much about fashion and it doesn't have to be designer. You don't have to spend so much money on clothes to enjoy it. I am sweating. Regarding outfits, I feel like I have enough of like the casual and nice fits. So now I'm packing my sweatshirts in my hoodies. And um, this is actually a sneak peek of something that is coming out literally tomorrow. 
as you see this video, this collection is going to be launched tomorrow. And it is the original collection that I launched at first, but they are in different colors now. This is the navy blue and I literally am so obsessed with it, y'all. These are premium hoodies. The quality is amazing and it's a heavyweight fabric. Here's the back. So I am going to be bringing this in navy blue. And here are the sweatpants. So it has the Gymshark. And then we also have it in brown and I believe black as well. The cool thing about the brown is the back is like tonal. The bottoms as well. I literally cannot wait for y'all to have these hoodies. Whenever we created them, I was like very keen on making sure these were premium and they just feel so cozy. And if you do like to cover your butt, I would recommend sizing up so it does cover it in full. All right, I have these packing cubes where I'm going to put all my clothes and everything that I need into them. So it's very organized. Make sure you subscribe so you can see the next video, which is uh, going to be the London vlog. no idea how I made it, but I literally finished packing with 10 minutes to spare. I am about to head to the airport. I am going to London. I'm gonna be there until next Monday. So um, make sure you stay tuned for the next video if you want to see what happens in London. I love you so much and I will see you in the next video. Mwah.